Hello friends, welcome back. This is Manish Pandey. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to unhide columns, how to unhide single column and how to unhide multiple columns also. So let me show you how to unhide columns in Excel in UiPath using Invoke VBA. So let's say here we have this Excel file and we have column A that is hidden, column C to E that is hidden, column H to I that is hidden. So first I'm going to show you how to unhide column A. So I'm going to show you how to unhide single column, only one column at a time. So for that, first you need to open one Excel file, go to file. So go to option, click on trust center, then settings, and then click on macro settings, then check, check this checkbox and then click OK, click OK. And I want to unhide this column A. So for that, what you can do in UiPath Studio. So for that, you have to use Excel application scope and then double click here, select that Excel file, take one activity that is invoke VBA, select here. Now here we need to pass that subroutine name, that entry method name and here we need to pass that source code file path. It means this is the file where we will write our VBA code to unhide the columns. So we have this code which we will use or this invoke VB activity will use to unhide the columns. So this is to unhide the single column. We have sub and then routine name, subroutine name. This can be any name like unhide column or unhide single column or like just unhide. So sub and here and sub. So these codes should be written within sub and and sub. Now you need to pass here seats of the seat name. So this is the seat name from this Excel. So I'm going to unhide the column from raw data seat. So you need to mention that seat name here, then dot columns of A. So which column you are going to unhide. So you can either put here columns name uh, that this name because this is the name of that or you can put the column index like one, two, three. So column A is one, column B is two. So you can directly put here one. So it will just unhide that column or you can directly enter that a specific column name that is A, B, C, D like that. I'm going to show you both way. So A column I am going to unhide. Now save this one and copy this. So we are going to call this method, right? So copy, go to this, first select that file. So we have this file which is here and pass here and now run that. So what will happen? It will just unhide this column A. Now you can see here, now let me hide this again, save this and what I'm going to show you here, I'm going to show you, you here using column index, column number. Now I'm going to put here 1. So it will unhide this column 1, it means column A. Run this one and you'll see here now it will unhide column A. Right? Now let's say you want to hide all this, like you have C, D, E, this 3 this multiple columns is hidden and you want to unhide that. So for that we have to use multiple code. So we have this code. We need to use seats of that seat name dot columns of let's say you, you have only one so you can write A. If you want to unhide like C to E so you can mention C to E. If you want to just unhide C to D, C to F, C to G like that so you can mention here. If you just want to unhide only C to E. So you'll do like this C to E. Now save this and copy this one and come here, paste here and run this one. So now it will unhide this column C to E. Right? So you can see here now column C to E is unhidden now. Now let's say if you don't know which columns I want to unhide, so how can you do that? So at least you will have idea like uh, by looking at this Excel sheet, you know that okay, we have only A to R column which is in huge, right? So what you can do, let's say I'm not going to pass only G to or like S to I. I'm, I'm just going to pass A to R and whatever columns is hidden that will just unhide right so how can we do that if you don't know which column 
but you know that a specific columns which is in use you know that from a column to t columns which is in use so if any column is hidden that will be only within this range only a to t so what you can do there is an easy way you can just put here a to t save this one now this a to t it means within this range a to t columns if any column is hidden that will be unhidden now save this one save this code also and now run this one so you see here now you can see here this h2i is now un unhidden so by this way you can unhide the columns even if you don't know which columns you want to unhide but if you have the specific range you can unhide this one so i hope this is useful if so please like this video and please subscribe this channel if you are new to this one thank you so much for watching this video if you want to learn blue prism please visit my youtube channel youtube.com slash blue prism rpa and also if you want to learn blue prism from udemy and you want to get certificate you can search for my blue prism course th there that is blue prism rpa complete course i will also put the link in in my video description you can go through that there thank you